I recently managed two achievements. I finished med school finals and I leveled up my heavy character to level 50 in Star Wars Battlefront 2. These two things felt weirdly similar. Although one is in real life and one is in a video game. That's because video games and real life have more in common than you think. Video games give you three key experiences. Gaining XP, leveling up, and getting good at something difficult. You gain XP from every little action you take, every enemy you defeat, and every second you spend defending a base. Then you level up when you gain enough XP, and ultimately this allows you to buy better gear and level up your character. In real life, you can have quite similar experiences. If you're practicing for an exam, then every practice question you do nets you some XP. Gain enough XP and you level up. You get to master pharmacology, cardiology, genetics or whatever. The ultimate goal is to get good at your field so that you will be looked upon by your peers. That's where I'm trying to get with medicine. Inevitably, you will lose a match in a video game. Some people get absolutely irate when this happens. This is exactly because video games and real life rely on the same underlying process. This process is so satisfying and so important that if you don't have access to it in one area of your life, you will do all it takes to seek it in another. What is that process? That process is incremental progress towards a valued goal. The reason why some gamers get so salty may be because winning a game of supremacy is their main source of life satisfaction. I get a little bit salty, but not to the point that I berate my team. That's because I gain life satisfaction from other areas as well. I go to the gym, I study medicine, and I'm building a relationship with my girlfriend. If you don't have other sources of life satisfaction, then you'll rely on the only thing you have. The other similarity is hierarchy. No matter how good you get, there's always a bigger fish. There's always someone faster than you, stronger than you, and better than you. Same applies in real life. Someone knows more, someone gets the job done faster, and someone tells you what to do. Finally, the game always ends, and so does life. At the end of your life, what do you want to have accomplished? What do you want to have done and experienced? This is not a video to disparage you, this is a video to wake you up. You may have leveled up in a video game and accomplished quite a lot. But what if, instead, you leveled up in life? If you feel like video games control you and not the other way around, then I've got just the thing for you. I made an online course that allows you to take control of your digital life. It's called Digital Discipline. It's all about detaching when necessary, eliminating all the bad stuff, and doubling down on what works. I will teach you how to regain control of your social media, gaming, and streaming services. I will teach you how to gain XP IRL by doing deep work. All this is yours for a mere £49, so head on over to ro.blog dd and get started today. Click here for another video and click here to subscribe. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.